Hi, I'm Pam on behalf of Expert Village, and I'm going to teach you how to bring home fundamentals learned at school. Again, toys and games might sound like the kid is just having fun in the classroom, but again, they're actually learning vital skills that are going to help them later on in life. They learn to cooperate, share, take turns. They develop confidence when they complete something successfully, like putting a puzzle together all by themselves. They practice their hand-eye coordination when they're lacing together a card. They're also learning about colors, animals, anything that you can talk to them about. They practice hand-eye coordination when they're putting a peg into a pegboard. They experiment with invention and construction when they're building things. One thing you can do is comment if you notice that they make a pattern, like it goes blue, green, yellow, blue, green, yellow. Comment on that. Ask them about it. Ask them if they did it on purpose or not. You can help them put together a puzzle if they're having trouble with one, or just play a game with them. Matching games are great. They help expand their math skills. So, lay the cards out. It's usually pretty good if you always let the kid win. But you lay the cards out, everybody's played a matching game, you flip them over, and you match the pictures. They're easy, they're cheap, you can make them at home if you want out of just a piece of paper and crayons. Let the kid make them themselves, they're going to want to play with it more. They also learn, it increases their vocabulary as they're talking about things. They're going to learn new words, they're going to ask you something and you can explain it to them. So toys and games actually are really educational. 